Hey guys, this is Josh Koval with MLC CAD Systems and today we're looking at user efficiency tools. When a user approaches me, the most common question I get is how to get faster. How can I be more efficient in my design work? That rabbit hole runs pretty deep, but today we're going to look specifically at user interface shortcuts. Looking at the interface, all your work is done here in the graphics area. This is where the money's made. Time spent here is value added. Time spent here in the toolbars searching for tools is non-value added. To help us spend more time here in the MoneyMaker, SolidWorks gives us keyboard shortcuts, mouse gestures, and the shortcut bar. Let's create a few shortcuts. Access the Tool Shortcuts menu by right-clicking anywhere in the toolbar and select Customize. Across the top of this menu, you'll find tabs for the different types of shortcuts we have access to. To create a keyboard shortcut, navigate to the Keyboard Shortcut tab, select or search for a command, and type in the shortcut you'd like to use. SolidWorks protects you against overriding a command that already exists. In this case, I want to leave Control-C as the copy shortcut, so let's select something else, hit OK, and you're ready to go. Next, we have the shortcut bar. Personally, I prefer the shortcut bar over any other shortcut method. A quick press of the S key accesses the bar, and I have more customization options. Let's take a look at what I mean. In the Customize dialog under the Shortcut Bar tab, I can navigate to the specific bar I want to add a tool to drag and drop the tool, hit OK, and I'm ready to roll. Back in the Customize window, let's move over to the Mouse Gestures tab. Mouse Gestures are similar to the shortcut bars in that there's one for each type of function or file we're working in, and we have options for the number of shortcuts we can have. To set up a shortcut, drag and drop a command from the command list onto the gesture wheel, and I'm ready to go. I prefer the shortcut bar, but I've met users who swear by mouse gestures. Take some time to figure out what works best for you, and roll with it. Guys, I hope you found that tech tip useful. If you did, hit the subscribe and notification button below to be kept up to date with the latest in SolidWorks news, and thanks for watching.